Welcome to part 5 of the series on business process automation. This time we talk about the potential of robotic process automation. My original plan was to put the robotic process automation topic much later in the series, after some more basic things. But due to a request from Jan, thank you Jan, I put it here and I'll do more than just one video on robotic process automation. After all, the series is for you and relevance is more important than the right order. Robotic process automation is a great idea. The term evokes an association with mechanical robots. And we can in fact imagine a robot typing on a computer keyboard instead of us. This is also interesting from a philosophical point of view. Robots become users of computers just like us. So from some perspective they are on the same side. Of course building a mechanical robot typing on a keyboard and holding a mouse is possible but very expensive. It's much easier to build a software agent that does this. And therefore robotic process automation really is a software agent that interacts with applications via the user interface. And in business process automation, how do we ordinarily interact with applications? Well, we use an application programming interface, API for short. And how does robotic process automation work? In its most basic form, it's just a keyboard and a mouse. So commands like move the mouse to coordinates X, Y on the screen, click and then type ABC. In a more advanced form, robotic process automation uses knowledge about the application it's operating on. And many applications are web-based. So robotic process automation can directly select HTML elements in the browser. Robotic process automation can also directly interact with Word or Excel sheets, for example. An advantage of this advanced form is that we are less dependent on the screen resolution. So that's how it works. What is the potential for business process automation? A workflow is a series of tasks, human and machine tasks. With robotic process automation we can do two things. First, we can replace simpler or tedious human tasks with robots. And second, we can access machines where we don't have access to an API. And so we can greatly expand the boundaries of what can be automated at a reasonable cost. So is RPA the magic wand that solves all IT problems? There are some people that may want to suggest this. I have talked to vendors, developers, customers and users of robotic process automation. Some enthusiastic, some critical. I have experimented with robotic process automation tools in combination with classic business process management systems. And I want to share this experience with you so that you can successfully introduce robotic process automation in your organization and avoid being disillusioned. So stay tuned and ask questions in the comments.